Hello everyone, Mage Knight 404 here with Omega. And we're back to let's play Bomberman Hero. Last yeah, time indeed. I actually failed to get my gold medal, so I went back off screen and got and got the five on Endel. Got my gold medal! Arr, yeah! So we're on to Area <laughs> this Planet 2. Primus. I, I don't think the audience is excited for it as you are. Well, I, I I have to pride myself on my gold on my gold medal. I must have my gold medal. Anyway, to the woods of Esserum, area one, we go into Grook Hills. Indeed. Yeah, I'm, I'm lagging a whole lot more than usual. Yeah, what the hell is that is all about? The yeah. princess is very close. I'm gonna take over for you from the meantime. I was about to say, cause yeah, it's gonna be a while it's before I actually get capital. any text. Oh god. <laughs> Primus Castle is just ahead, but the guard is tough. Yeah, I just saw the first line. Find the underground tunnel that's connected to the lake. Will do. Very specific. I hate this place. I really fucking do. Each of the groups too, kill them. I'm not too crazy about it myself. Defeat quick groups by dropping bombs and running away. Seriously. The minute they spot you, they they will fucking chase you to the ends of hell. Ah! They remind me they remind me of the giant trees from Dark Cloud 2 that I hated so much. Oh shit, fucking bastard. Suck bomb! <laughs> it would help if I actually saw these things when they happened. So what exactly are those things supposed to be? Like little rats or something? I don't know, something like that. Tauruses. Taurus FM's your favorite uh Super Robot Wars enemy. <laughs> Shut up. I know. Teehee. It's funny because Ray actually hates him. Usually getting a 5 on this stage is always a bit of annoyance for me because always, there's always one item I miss before, well, before a scene transition, shall we say. Yeah. You'll see. Life up. I, I still could have sworn I remember some levels. flowers at the same time and they'll give you flowers, sprinkles. What Pipe is talking about? Well, we're about to find out. I still could one there were some levels that you didn't actually have to get every single point. No, there are some that are a little more lenient than others. Or there are a few excess points. Mostly the gear missions, yeah. I think. Or I, I know I definitely remember those being a little bit more lenient. Those flower enemies are kind of scary. They're, at, they're out. They're assholes. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, just in design, I mean, that's, that's, that's going, a little, I'm, I wouldn't want to be one of those. To, I'm going to scan the area just to make sure I don't miss any, haven't missed anything. Reminds me of, uh, the, at the risk of sounding extraordinarily nerdy, and I'm pretty sure uh, you don't know much about this raid. Reminds me of uh, Black Rose Dragon from Yu-Gi-Oh, which is terrifying to me. No, oh, I can't yep. say I know what that is. <laughs> Well, it's it's like a flower dragon. It has a bunch of like spiky rose tentacles and crap, and it's pretty, it's pretty terrifying. I'm, I'm thoroughly scared of black rose dragon. Huh? I, w I would not I would not want to meet one in an alleyway. Ah! Or sky. There it is. I always forget that island exists. Wow. Oh, well, good. Now I have level three bombs. I can clear this place without fear. Attack the I mean, freeze flower with a rolling bomb. Yeah, this is a freeze flower. What you want to do to? Trigger tr scene transition is set up a rolling bomb, then blast the hell. <laughs> Suddenly ice, and a lot of the I items that were overhead are now suddenly on the ground. For some Roll with it. Yeah. Not not as uh. Consistent as the freeze flowers from our galaxy. No. Oh. Well, yeah, this is the only way you're getting a five on this stage. 
And, and, and with this, with how awkward they explain it to you, you could very easily miss this. I missed this for quite some time as a kid. I didn't care as a kid. <laughs> so. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck are they talking about? And I'm like, what, this, what is this thing? What's a rolling bomb? What's an airport? <laughs> I still don't know what a bomb ladder is in Bomberman 64. Those bomb ladders are mystical, are uh, are like an entity <laughs> all of their own. I, I know. I, there's there's like a whole set of Bomberman lingo that I'm just pretty much lost on because I just I like wanted to play the games when I was a kid. I didn't really care. <laughs> well, here's the thing: if you wanted to get through Rainbow Palace, you will know what a bomb ladder is before the day is done. I mean, if you want to 100% the first level of the game, you have to know what a bomb ladder is. So. Like, and I, I mean, seriously, the very first one, because in oh, yeah, that later is in life, anyway, that's a f going back and playing through that game again, and I was, yeah, I figured, hey, you know what, I'm going to 100% at this time, and what is all of this, <laughs> was what immediately followed that. <laughs> Alright, I don't know why this is lagging so bad, so I'm going to stop cash really quick to see if that fixes anything. Hey, guys, we're back! Let's do Bubble Hole now! <laughs> bubble hole. This music is pretty bad. That's time to enter the bubble hole. No comment. I'm immature, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, this music is I awesome. know. <laughs> oh, hey, look, Dragon Quest trampolines. Little trampoline. And they combine. Yes, they know how to do the fusion dance. Uh, and they're uh, I wish that's what they did. And they're suddenly, like, ten times harder to kill. Seriously. So they did do the fusion dance. <laughs> like, by the way, contain a secret, yeah, shut up, my watch. <laughs> you missed the shiny gem. Oh, no, and I didn't miss the shiny gem. What you talking about? I'm gonna go back for it. Just yeah, making sure. You can't miss the shiny gem. Did the bubbles give you points? See? What are you talking about? No, the bubbles. Aww. Okay, I thought you had to jump from it on the trampoline. The trampoline cancer blob. Actually, those are not trampolines, those are actually solid. Life up! Mm. They still look weird. <laughs> Friggin' jellies. Stop. So, I I've, already, I've already thoroughly planned out all of the completely unrelevant to this game commentary we'll be talking about today. Good, good, good! I was actually looking forward to that! <laughs> good. For, for one thing, I don't know how we had a Star Fox episode and didn't talk about Star Fox Adventures. Like, I, I don't know how that happened, oh, okay. but uh, we'll, correct, we'll, we'll correct that in this recording for you guys, so. <laughs> okay, let me, be, let me be the first to say this, then. Tricky is an asshole. Uh, you don't like Tricky? Well, well, I guess probably past Adventures. I mean, it, it, he, is, he is a dick at first, yeah. I, mean, I wasn't really crazy about the game mechanics that, that they did with with Tricky, but I mean, you know, compared to other Nintendo partners, sidekicks, and Nintendo games, you know, we'll, we'll do. Yeah. But uh, uh, all in all, I actually I, I enjoyed Star Fox Adventures as as a game. I thought it was all right, even if even I did just like rent it. Uh, I actually know where it is right now, <laughs> so. I, I could literally go pull it out of a drawer right now if I wanted to. Damn. Yep, I, I, I do know where. Because I, I keep all of my games like categorized, so I have all my GameCube games in the same drawer. And it's in there. The, the only thing that's, uh, that I really didn't like about the game is uh, there's a segment when you're in the... I can't even remember what the game called them. Like, the Raptors? Oh, no. uh, not, not, not the bad guys, the... Um, the like Velociraptors. I think they were called like Quick Foots, Fleet Foots, something like that. But uh, there's the part where uh, you get trapped in their village or whatever, and they like they tie you up to the pole, and you have to call the pterodactyl and and whatnot. And uh, like after that, you have to do these like trials, and there's a trial where you have to like essentially like outstrength this like this big raptor guy. You have to hit A a lot, oh, and I, I could never that. do it. I remember it. that fucking. I could never do it. That and fucking like, thing, seriously. 
Yeah, and it, it, it was funny because, uh, like, like the, the time that I finally beat it was, uh, I was trying it again for, like, the 50 millionth time, and, uh, like, uh, my sister's boyfriend was, was at our house at the time, and he happened to, to pass by on the way to the bathroom, and he saw me playing, and he was like, hey, man, what are you doing? You know, so I told him, and I was like, yeah, you know, like, yeah, I can't do this. He's like, well, hey, let me try. Does it on his first damn try. God damn. <laughs> And and that is coincidentally the only uh, time I've ever gotten past that segment. So I I usually lose motivation on some sequel playthroughs before I even get there. So but but I like Ow. the game. Fucker. Okay, yeah, don't say you. Fucking bubbles. Uh, well, that, that this went south fast. Ah, <laughs> uh, I keep telling you people I am usually not this bad at this game. You're getting bubble hold, Ray. I blame you! You said it! Uh, what? You said, welcome to bubble hole. I just said, the stage <laughs> name. I said, we're entering the bubble hole. <laughs> Getting your innuendo right. <laughs> Shut up! Damn you. <laughs> I'm gonna, you're gonna stand here, you're gonna watch us, like, bonk this thing into hell. Okay. Hopefully, we don't fall into the pit again. T technically, the game made it, not me, so... So, if, if, if you had to have Tricky or Pommy... I would take Tricky. Would I would take Tricky. You would take Tricky? I would take Tricky. <laughs> Tricky's not that much of a dick compared to Pommy. <laughs> okay, I was just wondering, because I, I know you weren't crazy about Pommy. Don't know why, Pommy's awesome. But... Oh, he's a douchebag. Fuck off. That's uh, that's why he's enjoyable. So if if it was tricky or navvy, uh, still tricky. Still tricky. Yeah. I, I, I like navvy. I thought she was endearing. No, no. Once you once you're like me and go to Majora's Mask, you can love Tattle and never go back. I I hated Tattle. <laughs> As a matter of fact. The Tattle is my my second least favorite partner character. Haddock Bomb! Second to Fee from Skyward Sword. Oh, I, I hate Fee. For, for everybody who watches play Skyward Sword, I don't like Fee. I really, really hate Fee. Minda's cool. I like Minda. Min Minda is probably was, my favorite. Minda was pretty good. Well, and, uh, I, I enjoyed once she, got, once, she, once she got her character development rolling, then she became really good. Yeah. I'm missing points. I mean, we're going to we're going to look scour this place for points. Hopefully not. Just don't die. I was about to say. I mean, like, you you're not supposed to like her at first, so that's kind of the point. She's supposed to start out a bitch, and she is very much a bitch to start with. But she gets she gets awesome. I like Minda. I wish that they wouldn't have plot twisted her into being hot. <laughs> yeah, like uh, like honestly, that kind of. I, I, I wasn't crazy about that, because they spend the whole game, you know, like, building up her character or whatever, and trying to get you to like her for who she is, and then plot twist, she's hot. And it was just like, <sighs> Nintendo. It's okay, I got a five, we can all move on in this world. <laughs> it's okay. It's, yeah, yeah, every, it's, everything will be okay, and frames are dropping. It's kind of like Mega Man Star Force 3, where they almost killed a character. Almost, and I was gen and I was genuinely surprised, and I was like, oh, well, but then you know you bring him back from the dead, basically, and I was like, oh, darn it, Capcom, you almost had a decent plot twist. <laughs> oh well, I guess it's I was I was pleasantly surprised. You had me going there, Capcom. I thought that uh, something. It's our leg. Guess what we're about to put on again? The bomber marine. Bomber marine. The bomber marine. Did we get a jet our way through bubbles? Um, maybe. Yeah, I don't really particularly care for this place too much, because there's a lot of winding paths. Actually, when I say winding paths, there are two, but... There are two exits to this place. There's plenty. <laughs> oh, this one has a secret exit? Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're gonna have to tell me these things. My memory of this game is blurry. No. There are specific no. stuff like I that. Know, I, know pretty, I know a lot about this game, so I'll, I can be happy to tell you. Yeah, I didn't 100% this as They go back and forth throughout the stage. 
they're bombable. Yeah. They can die. Unlike Mixers Makers, I, I didn't 100% this when I was a kid, so... Uh, that, that is, uh... On to it. Kill the bombs! With if, bombs! I'm not, even sure, I'm not sure if I even finished second strike. Or second attack, whatever it was called. Oh shit, I missed one. That would require for items to completion, though. They help in getting them faster, though. Hey, look! Easter Island heads. Yeah, I don't know what's up with that, but hey. More life up. Always handy to have around. Giant enemy clam! It's it's still uh, I still want to make Aquos jokes because that's honestly like every bomber marine level reminds me oh, shit, I missed of the one marine level from Star Fox 64. It's more than one. This. Not in 64. Not there's, in 64 not. there's not. Rainbow gem. I did. I didn't think there were any in the 3DS remake either. They add more? No. At least I'm pretty sure they didn't add more. Oh, yeah, here's, a, sure here's a big fucking mantra that shoots little dudes at you. They're malleable. So it's a giant enemy mantra, right? Yes. Here's something I need a one up. Because I lost, Manta I lost Ray. so many of them trying to get that five from Endel. <laughs> hey, Ray. Giant enemy manta ray. Shut up. <laughs> also, this thing pushes you back. Hey, I, I don't even know where I was going with that, so. So you have to get it in side to be close. Close enough that you can buff the Maybe. crap out of it, but not close enough that it knocks you back. Maybe he'll take your place in Persona 4. Oh, well, not now, because you killed him, but. These bomb the way. These block the way to the five warp points. Supreme victory to manhood. <laughs> Two of them will take you to the alternate pathways, and the other three will just warp you back to a portion of the stage. So you have to go through it again. I believe one of the X's is here. I'm correct. Yay. Did you have to actually go the other pathway? Like, is there anything super fancy on that? You have to go that. You actually, have to, you do actually have to go that way to get the other exit. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. So there are two exits to two different levels. I, I got you now. Is the center one the other one? No, it's not. It's a one. Okay. The other, I don't the know other, why. The other one is the, the other exit is in the top left. Darn. I would have failed. I don't know why I remembered it being the center. No, no missile torpedoes. The enemies, not the starfish. Those are invincible, by the way. It's that shark thing. Yeah. Well, you you would have killed him if they weren't. So. Bomb. I think our viewers could have inferred that they were invincible. Yeah. Oh god! Now I have not sounding bombs again. No. Fortunately, I don't have to hear it. Shall I go back and watch these videos? Land shark! Fucking shark! Stop dodging my attacks! Fucking land shark. <laughs> Shooting back like a boss. Hey, get back here! It's actually a land shark. Now I want to make twerwee jokes. There's a giant land shark boss in Twerwee. Oh god. With life. Oh, more life. And another one of these buggers. Stop pushing me back. Don't come at me, bro. <laughs> come at me, bro. I, mean, I like those jokes. I do like come at me, bro jokes. I, I like arrow to the knee jokes far more than I should. 
I mean, like, like the internet is so oversaturated with those by now. Fucking like they're they're like everywhere. Fucking Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> they are everywhere now, but I I, I like them. I do. They make I have me way laugh. more than enough, so I got my five and then some. Oh yeah, way more than enough. <laughs> All right. I I think you might have uh, overkilled just a little bit there, Ray. I don't care. Satisfying for the win. There's no kill like overkill. Final Fantasy X, anyway. Yeah, especially in ten. Yeah. Uh, no, don't worry, the, the next video is going to be the Final Fantasy video. Had it planned out already. God damn. <laughs> well, I'll have to be the next area, so... I know. I'm waiting for it. For another one up! Should not have done that. Yeah, no, that wasn't too... <laughs> it'll be okay. It'll be okay. Get out of my way! Stop convulsing! I'm supposed to blow up. Throw it asleep. Would you rather swim through, swim through some rings instead? Yes, I would rather. Then I get a star out of it. You would. Oh, yeah. There are these variants that this fucker I should have pointed out last time. They grow in size when you get close, supposed to just coming near you, then exploding. We want to go here now. <coughs> I'm surprised that you remember that. I'm surprised you do too, but okay. Wall through item, yes. We will be getting the wall through item. Otherwise, no one in common barman lore as the walk through soft blocks item. Uh, me and my friends never played much of the Bomberman Man multiplayer, so. We did on the 60, uh, Environment 64, we played some of that. I can remember playing that with friends. Mostly we just played like Pokemon Stadium and crap. Bomb. Which I cheated, I, I cheated when we played Pokemon Stadium together, so... <laughs> you see, w what you do is, when you're playing your friend at Pokemon Stadium, here's how you cheat, okay? You volunteer to be player two, right? Right. And see, like, whenever we play together, we always had this rule that uh, that you couldn't see uh, what your what the other person was picking, so the, the, whoever wasn't picking their team had to leave the room. And obviously, we were actually playing this on N64 because you know we're kids and whatever. So I would always volunteer to be player two, and then whenever like Ami or whoever would leave the room, I would just hit B and see his team, and then just like counter pick like a boss. Like a boss. <laughs> Uh, it took it took him years to catch me. I think like I, I did it for like two years before he finally caught me. So, <laughs> all right, <laughs> it's time to get wet in the waterway, and we have this really pretty obnoxious uh, sounding. Uh, did, did you have to do that? Really? Did you have after bubble hole? Shut up! You really had, you really had to do that. Giant enemy crab. What do you got? Crab battle. Fuck off! Okay. <laughs> Rainbow gems and stuff uh, okay. in peace, alright? Oh, no. Okay. Just like standing in place, like, hey, look at me, I'm important! Ah, I'm blown up! I, I think that is, in fact, what went through his mind. Way to go, Ray. You didn't have to die, you could have just walked away, but no, you just have to have your perfect score. No, oh, that dude I, had I a must wife. Have my first, no, I must have my perfect score. The world must die for my perfect score. How many families must you orphan, Ray? I must kill many! Fucking <laughs> hidden warp there for some reason. If for one gem, mm -hmm. like or was it two? It was two. Oh wow, two gems still. You're gonna have to, you're gonna have to make a. Actually, no, you don't. You do it. I was about to say, I don't think you have to make a dick jump. Life over there, hidden behind that. And super gems. Nothing over here, just more bubbles. Catch your star. Catch your star bits. I hate those spikes. Oh, I hate those spikes. Laser spikes. Back from X5. Yeah. We, we made that joke already. Oh, oh, oh. Must have. 
Did you play? Did you ever play the? Uh, did you ever play Command Mission? No. I think I've seen Command Mission, but I haven't played it. You never did. I I, I rented it one day. I I don't remember being very good at it, but I I do remember playing it. It was not very fun. <laughs> You got you to advance. Yeah, you the, the, this I do remember. I, I couldn't tell you. Oh god, a bomb! Grab these and run. Oh. Grab these and run. Grab these and run. And the world was safe. I did Indeed. Well, that room was Except not. for that one area of giant bomb. That one. That room but was yeah. not. <laughs> that area is not safe. Water slider with more obnoxious roof sound effects. We didn't have enough of those already. This asshole back from the first can't, area. Can't tell the gimmick to this level is, uh, besides the fact there's a chain chomp there. You're gonna be going down water. A lot. Hey. Uh, oh, I thought you missed him, Ray. You are not locked up, I was about to, Yeah, I was about to laugh at your perfect score. Being ruined. You, you cannot miss out on those. You can, you can go back for them. Darn it, game design. Uh, Why do you have to be? You're not gonna kill me that easily. Oh, no, no. Have you still not played Donkey Kong Country Returns? No. Oh, you should. They, they have some dick puzzle pieces in that game. Not that it's really a hard game, but I, I've kamikaze myself with, for puzzle pieces before. Many a time. That's a pretty dick jump. Not crazy about that jump. Way to go. Rainbow gem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bonk. Jelly blobs. Kill the blobs. They must perish. Way. Or not. <laughs> they could just be just fine. I guess that works too. What's up? Can't get away now, huh? Oh, wow. Way to. See, you, you just tortured that guy. I am a at, at least, At least get it over with fast. Are we missing some scores? Or are we... uh, I'm pretty sure I got it. I've been scores only 4,000. Oh wow! Like a boss. I was, to say, I was about to say because this is an odd number to stop on. So see, you didn't even have to kill that guy. You already had four thousand. I don't care. Must have. 